Hello. Hello, everybody. Today, we're going to be looking at Chapter 7. This map. Also, Josh is here, so I'd recommend you say hello. Oh, to our audience. Yeah. <sighs> My god. So, but, time to rate this map. So, what do you... So, let's go over the design of the map. What do you think of the design of this map? Superior. No, I mean, describe it. Very good design. Is, is there anything... Listen, I don't want to make this talk really short. Eh? We have to go in mm. detail about the design, the structure, the buildings. Very modern building. Then, you have, um... Like, which part stands out the most? Which, which the part stands out the most for you? The modern buildings. I would definitely say the, the planes definitely make this map a lot more interesting. As for the ending of the map, now, the ending of the map is definitely a lackluster. If you don't know this already, the map was originally supposed to include a lot more content in it. In it, such as the sorcerer, you know, revealing that, basically revealing his, the darker implications of the plan to summon the portal of untold stories, which is the thing that the story of the universe is. But that ended up being scrapped, and we still get interesting scenes regardless. We get John getting some character development, saying he's gonna make a sacrifice if he needs to. Because he knows he's going to become infected now. We also get to learn about how the helicopter here was even made in the first place. Thanks to Tiger, the sorcerer shows up and sort of bombs the plane. So, how would you rate this map? What tier do you think we should put it in? It gets... It gets, um... Well... I'd say spectacular, actually. It's not it's superior. It's what not do you think? Superior. What do you think holds it back from being uh, on top here? Hmm. Well, I guess the story is the thing holding it back, really. The story. I mean, I mean, fair enough. The story was pretty weak in this chapter, or somewhat. It wasn't like extremely weak, but you could tell that, you know, I was just kind of not focusing much on the story. The thing about chapter 6 is that puts it above most of the chapters. It's not just, it's just, it has a good story. It provides most of the sorcerer's backstory and its motivation. Really that it isn't just for no reason. There's not much depth to this chapter, but it, there's still depth that is there. It's not missing. It's just, you just really can tell that it's deeper than another chapter. It's not just that we're here with the end. To an end. So, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.